You can do this without me. Go. My friends keep asking me why I haven't got an engagement ring. You tease. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, thank you so much. Don't be alarmed. I'm speaking to you through the Guild Seal. You will need to jump into that hole to continue. Don't worry. The water at the bottom will break your fall. <coughs> Hey, welcome back, everybody. Yeah, that's right. I'm doing a little commentary. I didn't want to say anything before now because uh, we're in kind of like doing the storyline. But uh, one of my friends on YouTube requested that I do this. Those green orbs hold the knowledge and experience of the creatures that you kill. Yeah, so one, one of my uh, YouTube friends requested this game. So I thought I'd do it. The first part... Oops. Where? Where, boy? So I thought I'd do this game. You know what? Let me... Options... Audio... Make a wish! Make a wish! Let's try that. I was going to completely turn it off, but... Maybe I should. Uh... Audio... Let's turn music all the way off. It's distracting anyway. And it causes problems with your YouTube videos. 
Can we all say, copyright? And I'm trying to bring you gameplay. I'm not trying to violate any music copyrights. What is this? You'll have to shoot the switch to go any further. Oh, how do I do that? Uh, that'll work. Controls of the game aren't that bad. Oh. And the uh, sensitivity seems to be, uh, when it's on uh, default, seems to be pretty good. Just move forward and hold down A to move faster. And you swim like an Olympic swimmer. Now, am I the only one that's worried about these glowing mushrooms? I'm just saying. Talk about having a trip. Just a little claustrophobic in here. Oh, hyperventilating. Here we go. Graphics are pretty nice. I know this game's a little bit older. Fable 2 and all that. Fable 3 was 2008, and this is obviously older. Yeah. Collect that. Oh, there's something back here. Oh. Missed you, didn't I? I'm not sure what the orb count is for yet, but I'm sure we'll find out. And these beetles are everywhere. Someone needs to call Orkin. Orkin Pest Control. I mean, come on. This is just, just crazy. Damn. Damn you. Oh. Keep wanting to hit the trigger button. But in this game, X is sword. And Y is to uh, arm yourself with your, cr your crossbow and fire. And I think you have unlimited crossbow bolts. Which is always nice. Okay, here we are. Okay, so I think you have to shoot that one. Then it's got a sword on it, so sh strike it. And then shoot this one. And then strike it. Oh, okay. I messed that up a little bit. There we go. It's only three. Crossbow, sword, crossbow. Can we stop looking now? Okay. Through the fancy door. I mean, at least my feet on this character look more normal. You probably noticed in the first video I had unusually big feet or at least the shoes I was I was wearing were probably too big for me since I'm poor and I beyond find... these broken doors lies the hero's guild yeah he probably could only find for centuries water. this academy trained the most supremely gifted sons and daughters of Albion bound together by the blood that flowed in their veins once worshipped by the people of Albion the great heroes came to be feared and hated, 
No man alive today remembers the night the guild burned. And now, it lies forgotten. But the heroes are not all gone. You are here. And that same heroic blood flows through you. Look around at these walls. Your forebear, one of the mightiest heroes who ever lived. At a young age, he suffered a devastating loss, from which he never truly recovered. But when the world tried to crush him, he fought back. He grew strong, strong enough to reshape the world as he saw fit. You must do the same. The guild has reacted to you. Step into the light. Learn the true power of heroes. Now, from what I understand, the person talking to me that was uh, a main character in f fable, the first fable the ancestor whose blood runs through me is uh, her brother which makes her um, an ancestor of mine who is about five or six hundred years old because she's immortal an Im immortal seer little uh, information here we go your blood is awakening That's just, that's just You can little. now channel the experience you have collected into strength, skill, or will. Strength improves combat with hand-to-hand -hand weapons. Skill allows you to shoot faster and with greater accuracy. Will gives you control over the forces of magic. Okay. Before you is a colors gate. It reacts to the will of one who seeks to use it. You have not been able to use will yet. But the simple act of reaching this place has given you will experience. You need to learn a will ability to activate the colors gate. Hmm. Now use the knowledge you have gained so far to better yourself in strength, skill and will. Brutal styles unlock special moves. Okay. Can I do any skill? Dextrous styles unlock special moves for ranged weapons right, and other abilities crucial to a skilled fighter. Let's see, I picked this. Let's see what it says. Brutal styles unlock special moves for use in close combat. And let's go down the wheel and see what I opened up. Shock. Oops. Let's try that again. Oh, come on. Damn it. Damn it. Well, in any case, let's get back to it. Excellent. Can you feel the power coursing through you? It is only the beginning. Use your will ability to hit the flit switch and power up the gate. Really? Damn it. Once activated, it will allow you to travel back to Bower Lake. How exactly do I... Oh, B. Bam! Well done. Now you are ready to begin your journey. Use the colors gate. Use your newfound abilities to defeat them. Come on. Shocking, isn't it? Area of attack. Oh. 